way to Clumber Park. It is National Trust and it is in Nottinghamshire. We're going to be doing this in the view of how dog friendly is it, as we've obviously got our baby with us. Oh. Well, when, um, when I, I think when I first started coming, mm. you used to have like a terrier that used to take your cross out. No! Not, when we were kids? Yeah, but not when I No, first, I can't remember when we were. I cannot remember. Oh, it's. Okay, so we are walking around Clumber currently. In the rain. Unfortunately, it started to rain. Joanne was right, she needed the wet weather gear. I was quite content to walk around with a t-shirt and shorts on. Check my BBC. She, she's help. right again. We're just uh, down the top end of the lake where the bridge is, which it looks like you cannot go, I'll just turn this around. You can't go over in cars anymore because some idiot tried to uh, damage the bridge, which has obviously been here for a very long time. But it looks like they made a fantastic job of uh, repairing it which must have cost some considerable money but uh, they've really knocked a lot of it down but it looks like they've made a really good job of repairing it you can see up there the lake it's not very deep quite weedy but it's only about three foot deep there and there's a pan round. That's the, I don't know if you say call it a church, is it a church? Cathedral? Not sure what it is. And the house, and all the rest of the grounds are, are down there. And we're going to walk all the way around, which is, I guess, about three miles round. Doesn't take too long. It's quite a nice walk. Hopefully, this rain's going to hold off. The dog's drenched already. Joanne's. <laughs> changed as well and uh, we'll go and see what we can find that's just looking back at the bridge that we've uh, just walked over that two minutes ago it's still raining a little bit of a weary waterfall thing here still spitting but it's not as heavy we have had hail of all things on the 31st of may so this is where actually the other side now of uh, the sort of the main area where you're walking this part of the walk bill can actually be off the lead which is really nice we kept her on the lead around there um so yeah so she's she's quite enjoying it really she's to be honest she's much better on a walk somewhere where she doesn't know we should do a local walk there's all the swans like i say earlier the weather sun's trying to come out but it's a little bit of rain as well this part is great for Bo. She's off the lead. Um, it's nice underfoot for her. It's not really very busy today. She's passed a few dogs. All very friendly. Walking round the lake, seeing quite a lot 
of different birds so just saw one actually on the on the water and i wasn't quite sure what it was but it was actually anthony what was it now we found this a coot a coot which is black with a white beak anthony wasn't sure we knew it he knew it wasn't a moorhen because they've got a red beak oh there's some baby ones here i think that's a baby one yeah it is yeah Gosh, look how long the legs are. There's Boo. A bit muddied up. I think she's been eating something. I'm a bit worried that she's um, maybe found some mouldy bread. Maybe it's left for the swans and the ducks. But the weather has, has improved. So the last time I came here was been autumn, October half term, so autumn and really pretty the colours were stunning obviously which it always is wherever you go anywhere in autumn but it's lovely to see it these the colours there's lots of nice colours obviously the other good thing is when it has rained part of it we were under cover with the trees so that's that has helped yeah but you can see there's not many people about it's coming round the lake and we're now going back into the it's called the pleasure ground where this park bill has to be on a lead uh, Anthony was just saying this is an overspill car park just over there um, he said they have like events and concerts and things here yeah well, I thought it was I could be wrong and it's just just out with the weather it's like are you sure it's yeah. not no, look. it's like sandstone it's just weathered away Mm -hmm. Looks like it's designed like it, doesn't it? Yeah, it did. I thought it was. I thought it looked quite good. So yeah, Boo's back on the lead now. How far have we walked up to now, Anthony? Uh, 3.6 miles. Getting back to the like the visitor centre, basically. Um, this is a really pretty... I suppose even if you can't... If it's too much to walk around the lake, just having a walk up and down here is quite a nice thing to do, Anthony. Isn't it? It's a pleasant walk, just... Again, it's National Trust, it's well maintained. Hi. On the lead down, I'm sorry. You've had a good walk off the lead, Bo. Yeah, mm -hmm. this is lovely all around here. Like I say, what I was saying is if someone else's mobility is maybe not too far to walk around the lake, just to walk up and down here is lovely. It's pretty, I mean, oh, it's lo say last it's time I came, watch yeah, watch the world go by basically. <laughs> yeah, yeah. drinking a really flask. <laughs> I don't know what they used to use this. Well, years, there was a house here, apparently. Years and hundreds of years ago. Well, it was a country estate, was it? Was. Yeah, yeah, probably. <laughs> don't take her down there, Auntie, they'll attack her. They might attack her, they said. Peaceful as well, actually. I think because it's rained a few people, so oh, we're not going to hang about. Well, it's raining, but it's yeah. cleared up, hasn't it? I think while we was walking around, the cafes was probably heaving. Yeah. Basically. This is Boo. We've stopped for coffee. <laughs> Boo was having a dog ice cream. I feel like she's had one of these. Not every dog gets <laughs> spoon fed by their owner. Well, it's only because it's dirty down there. She normally eats <laughs> it out the tub. She's just sort of shaking with excitement. This is different to the other ones that she's had. She has had this before. I know it doesn't react with her. Mm. Not that I'd let her have it all the time. <laughs>